with a yo ho ho it's tale of the toaster welcome back to let's play in azuma 11 go light in the last episode we lost to prodigy grammar 3-1 by fifth sector's orders well i mean they wanted a 3-0 but because we got that goal coach travis got fired so we're gonna feel the aftermath of that in this episode the captain seems to be taking a lot of time off lately maybe that goal he scored at the end of the friendly is still playing on his mind so what's the plan if we don't have a coach, we don't have a firm direction for the team. We don't really need a coach if you ask me. It'll just be some faceless mouthpiece from 5th Sector anyway. Huh? Who's that? And just when you think that Percival Travis is the best coach that that team could possibly ever have, we found the one person in the whole world who could possibly make for a better coach than the coach of Inazuma National. We have now got Mark Evans as a coach. And, oh my gosh, it... I love his redesign, apart from the excessive orange. I don't I don't know why his, his dress sense is so very orange. But that voice, I think it's clear to see why I picked the Mark Evans voice that I did in the first three Let's Plays now. It didn't sound like him at all in those games, but now I think, yeah, Mark Evans gets a complete voice redo. What was the Holy Emperor thinking? <laughs> yeah, you're the only one who's got to be directly negative about it. So we'll talk to these three before we head to Riverside for the training. It all just seems a bit hard to believe. Yeah, you're telling me, mate. But what does he mean? Something he hasn't seen round right here yet. Well, go to Riverside and find out, eh? Play to win, he said. That's not the kind of thing you'd expect to hear from a fifth sector coach. Uh, what does he want us to do now anyway? Just a bit of training? Don't ask me. In fact, you know what? I don't trust the guy. I'm not going. I'm afraid I feel the same way. This training in Riverside sounds like risky business if you ask me. But what about what the coach said? Don't you want to know what that thing that might be easier to see down there is? Nope. Don't care. Well, I see. <laughs> you know, it is Mark Evans. So no one wants to do this training. I just want to learn from Coach Evans and get better. A lot better. Come on, let's head down to Riverside. Okay, Alonzi. Well, at least we've got two people signed up for it. What is the meaning of this winter's here? 
He seems to be at odds with the recruitment data we received from Fifth Sector. Ah, indeed, sir. But when I checked with Fifth Sector, they formally confirmed it. Mark Evans is Ryman's new coach. What the dickens? Ah, sometimes a Holy Emperor's way of thinking is impossible to fathom. And so we'll go. And yeah, I mean, my reactions to Mark Evans being the coach, I did learn prior to playing the game, as you might expect. I was a li initially a little bit tentative about it because we had just had three games in a row with Mark Evans in it. And then I thought having a new hero was quite refreshing because I wasn't that attached to Mark Evans as a character. But Coach Evans, to me, feels like a very different character, actually. And, as it turned out, Arian Sherwind, our supposed new main character, is pretty much Mark Evans again. So, I, I warmed up to this idea very quickly. Good to see you both. And you, Coach. I can't wait to train with you. Oui, it is an honour. <laughs> Loosen up, you two. You'll do yourselves an injury. Now, I hear you've got good dribbling skills, Arian. And you're a born jumper, JP. So first, we're going to work on your strong areas. Arian, you practice dribbling, and JP, you can do some heading drills. Yes, coach. Just you watch. I'm going to be unstoppable. That's really Mark Evans? Yeah, don't believe it. He just looks like a normal gadget. Okay, now for some shot practice. Come at me. Yes, coach. Huh. I could do better than that. I suppose it does look rather fast. Hey, you lot. Why don't you stop golfing and come down here and train with us? Oh, hey, guys. Ben, you lost nothing. You're actually going down there. Wait, Kaiser! Everyone's slowly joining in. Coach Evans managed to draw them all in somehow. Back when he was in, the club was about to be abolished, but he turned them around. They even won a national tournament. Great stuff, everyone! Victor! Get over here and take a shot! What? Don't you get bored? Just standing there watching all the time. Come on, let's play football! Good. Oh. When you say that, it makes my skin crawl. Really? Whatever. I'll show you my shot. The atmosphere has turned a little chilly here, Arion. And so we do get a very brief interlude for the, from the many voice acted lines, but there's, there's so few people to talk to in the surrounding area that, yeah, we're done already. Alright, give me your best shot. Very well. Well, 
I came because I wanted to play football. I know I'm not all that good yet, but I really, really love playing. Great to hear. Well, there'll be plenty more training at Rhyme on tomorrow. See you there. Yes, coach. Maybe with Mark Evans as coach, we'll be able to play real football. I can't wait to tell Auntie Sylvia about this. She'll be over the moon. So a real treat for the players of this game there. Yeah, every single Mark Evans line in this entire episode has been voice acted. So it's given me very, very little to do. But don't worry, you'll get to hear the return of my Mark Evans voice probably in the next episode. I was originally intending to... That was weird, the dialogue sound kept going. I wanted to get in, stuck into the extra competition route now, but unfortunately, because Ricardo is currently off the team and Victor is still unusable for a while, actually I have only one single player with special moves, so I think I simply have to save that until I at least have the option to play as Ricardo again. So instead, we're just going to go home and talk to Auntie Sylvia. Auntie Sylvia, guess what? We have a new coach! Guess who it is? Mark Evans! The Inazuma National Legend! Huh? Mark? Mark from school? Huh? Do you know him, Auntie Sylvia? Of course. We were in the same year at school. I thought I'd mentioned it before. Well, I can't believe you didn't tell me! So, what's he really like, then? Well, let me see. I suppose... He's a little bit like you, Arian. What? Really? If Mark's your new coach, I think you'll come along in leaps and bounds. I always hated Coach Travis anyway. I'm sorry, Evans. I'm putting a lot of responsibility on your shoulders here. Oh, no, really. It was just a surprise when you called, that's all. Football, as we knew it, no longer exists. Victory has no meaning anymore. The only prize for winning now is regret. Regret for betraying the spirit of the game. It's bad, isn't it? Football has degenerated into a tool for self-promotion. Is this what we were fighting for when we won the Football Frontier International? Coach, we need to get back to those days. We need to find a way back. We have a terrifying opponent standing in our way, Evans. I hope you realise that. You mean fifth sector? It isn't only middle school football they're trying to control, coach. They want the whole game. Right now, Ryman Football Club hasn't got a leg to stand on. All we've got is him, our glimmer of hope. I know. He's a bright lad after all. <laughs> well, I'm leaving it up to you, Evans. The club... The future of football? Yes, coach! You're the coach now. So, you better not bungle this up, Coach Evans. I'll set things right, I swear. I'm not giving up any time soon, either. 